Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can add drawing elements to the taskbar area within your Gantt chart. Drawing objects can provide additional information or serve to illustrate important data within the Gantt chart view. To add a drawing object to your Gantt chart, click the Drawing button that appears in the Drawings group on the Format tab of the Gantt Chart Tools Contextual tab within the ribbon. Then select the type of drawing object that you want to add to the chart from the drop-down listing that appears. You can then click and drag over the area within the chart where you would like to draw the object. Once the object has been placed, you can click on it to select it and format it. You can tell when a drawing object is selected because it will appear with small black resizing squares around its perimeter. You can place your mouse pointer over one of the resizing squares until your mouse pointer turns into a double pointed black arrow, and then click and drag your mouse pointer in order to resize the selected shape. You can click into the center of the shape and then drag it to a new location in order to move the shape. To format a selected shape, click the Drawings button again and select the Properties command from the drop-down menu. In the Properties dialog box that appears, you can change the formatting of the selected shape. On the Line and Fill tab, you can use the options in the Line and Fill sections to change the outline and fill color of the selected object. You can select the None option in either section to remove the line or fill from the shape. You can select the Custom option in either section to apply a custom line or fill color. If you select this option, simply use the Color drop-down to select a desired fill color. Now in the line section, you can use the line drop-down to select a desired line thickness, and in the fill section, you can use the pattern drop-down to select a desired fill pattern. When you're finished, you can simply click the OK button. Now if you wish to attach the shape to a task or to a specific day in the Gantt chart, then click the Size and Position tab. In the Position section, you can then select either the Attach to Time Scale or Attach to Task option. If you select the Attach to Time Scale option, then you can select the date to use from the Date drop-down. You can also enter in a vertical measurement from the top of the taskbar area where you want the shape to appear in the vertical text box. If you select the Attach to Task option, then you can enter the task number into the ID field and then select to which end of the taskbar to attach the shape from the attachment point. You can then enter a horizontal and vertical measurement from the left and top of the taskbar area where you want the shape to appear in the horizontal and vertical text boxes. When you are finished setting the formatting properties for the selected shape, simply click the OK button in the Format Drawing dialog box to apply them. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.